I'm Honda Pro Jason. Welcome to the Honda Pro Show. Watched by millions worldwide and kept alive because you subscribe. This week, I have stories about a new hydrogen car from Japan, the NSX going up Pikes Peak, and the new Civic Hatchback coming to the United States. All this and more coming up next. Welcome to this week's edition of the Honda Pro Show. I'm Honda Pro Jason and I'm solo today. No cameraman Matt. It's okay though, cameraman Matt will be returning next week. I'm gonna start the show off by talking to you guys about a visit I took to Marysville, Ohio to see the only US built supercar being made. Yes, at PNC out in Marysville, Ohio, Honda is making Acura is making the new NSX, and I was there to witness it. It was epic. I have a full video that's gonna be released on March 17th, all about the journey, all about the build. You guys are gonna love it. And it also leads me into my very first story. The NSX is being brought to Pikes Peak Hill Climb, and that's gonna happen very soon. Honda's actually bringing two NSXs. One is gonna be pretty much factory form. They're gonna add a roll bar for some safety. The second one is where it gets interesting. The second one is going to be not a hybrid. It's gonna be a rear wheel drive only, but they're gonna add some electric superchargers to the mix. So electric superchargers and 500 plus horsepower. This is gonna be some pretty epic, epic drives up Pikes Peak. I'm really interested to see how this one turns out. The show is watched worldwide. So when I say the new Honda Civic hatchback is coming back, I really mean for the United States because you lucky ones that live around the rest of the world still have a Civic hatchback. We don't, but we're getting one. In fact, the whole world is getting one. And judging by these pictures of the new Civic prototype, it looks outstanding. These photos were taken from the Geneva Motor Show. I'm gonna be able to see this car in person in New York on March 22nd. Now here's where it gets interesting. My friends over at Auto Guide talked about the six things they learned about the new 2017 Honda Civic hatchback. Let me read them off to you. First thing, no two liter engine. Wait, no two liter engine? Yep, it looks like the Honda Civic hatchback is gonna be a 1.5 liter or a 2.0 liter turbo only. So there will be no naturally aspirated engine choices for this car. The Type R will be a hatch. Sounds like it's confirmed. The Type R, Civic Type R, will be a hatchback and will be sold worldwide. Hybrid could be a future. So there could be a hybrid. I like that idea. The Civic might be the next Accord, number four. The Civic might be the next Accord. Well, it kind of makes sense. If they're gonna make this worldwide platform, it's possible that they could adjust the platform and the body to fit an Accord on the Civic chassis. That'd make things kind of interesting. It was inspired by Lamborghinis. I don't have to say anything else about that. And the final thing is, we'll get it first. We'll get it first, yes. It sounds like it's official that the US will be the very first country to get the new Civic hatchback. Sorry, UK and Canada, but it's about time we do something first here. The headline reads, $20,000 self-driving car by Honda, kind of. And that was by the Wall Street Journal, and well, they're right. You can buy a base model Civic LX with all Honda sensing technology for about $20,000. And the car is pretty close to a self-driving car. It has adaptive cruise control, a low speed follow, which will follow the person in front of you all the way to a stop. So the car will keep its own speed. It'll stop by itself. With lane keeping assist, it'll actually stay in your lane so the car pretty much drives itself. And this is really the first step towards autonomous driving. I mean, if they gave us an autonomous driving car, a self-driving car today, and said, just go out there and let the car drive itself, it would probably freak us out. But if we drove a Civic for a while, or one of the other cars that have all of the sensing technology, and in five or 10 years gave us a self-driving car, 
we'd probably be a lot closer. So Honda, you're definitely thinking ahead and I cannot wait for self-driving cars. The Honda Clarity just went on sale in Japan. Why should you care? Well, the Honda Clarity is powered by hydrogen. So the only thing that comes out of the tailpipe is water vapor. You can go 466 miles on a tank of gas. You can actually power your whole house for seven days off of the system. It's pretty insane, like so many things you can do with a hydrogen car. And this car is coming to the US and the world very soon. And now for some international news from India. Honda's coming out with a new model. It's called the WRV. Looks like it's gonna be based off the Fit or the Jazz, and it's gonna be a four-wheel drive version. It's gonna be great for that country. It's fun fact time. On the 2017 Acura NSX, every bolt that goes into metal gets started by hand. And that's your fun fact of the week. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I'm the Honda Pro, and now you're in the know.